Hey guys, it is Simlissa, and we are in Brindleton Bay today. Um, I downloaded the Country Kitchen Kit. I am looking for a house that kind of embodies that. So I don't know why, but my first thought was Brindleton Bay. I think the houses here are so beautiful, and um, some of them kind of have that country vibe to me. So I think I want to do the boathouse here. Um, it's kind of small. It's like a one bedroom, one bath. I think I can give it some country charm and make it really, really cute. So let's go for it. Well, this is really cute. Let's see where it's located. Oh, wow. Okay. It's right on the beach. How beautiful. Well, I actually don't see that much wrong with the outside. I mean, let's see. I don't, I don't like the green shutters, so that I would probably see if there's another color I liked better, but um, overall, I think this looks pretty good. Like, I don't really know what the inside looks like. Let's take a look at that. Oh. Oh, okay. Huh. Um, yeah. I think we're going to have to do some reworking of this. What does the upstairs look like? Oh, my. Okay. Wow, that's not very big. That's not horrible, but, um, yeah, we could do something with that, I think. I feel like these walls look really short. We have to make those bigger or something. I don't know. Upstairs, anyway. Okay. Um, let's see what we can whoops I didn't mean to do that let's see what we can do with the outside first you know what I see that we've got some pillars and a porch here and well never columns and a porch and you guys know how much I hate those darn tall columns so I think I'm just gonna get rid of this not even try because I'll just end up deleting it right <laughs> so I think we'll just get rid of it to begin with I feel so much better. Yes. And I think that we should pull this out, make it match that side of the house. Maybe. I see what they've done though. They want to match. They're trying to match all the greens up with these green shutters. So if I change them, that's probably going to be a problem, but I feel like we can, I feel like we can do it. It's going to be okay. It's going to be all right. Yeah. I kind of like, do they have like navy or something. Well, that's blue. This looks navy to me, but it's probably like a dark gray. I think I'm going to try that and see how that looks. So let me change these real quick and we'll see how that looks. Because I might change the siding too. I think it's kind of plain in that color. My daughter was watching my last video and she said um, that she doesn't think I use enough color. So maybe we should make it a bright color. All right, let's see what we got. Why does this roof look so super long? Why are there two roofs? That's weird. Oh, well, that's why. <laughs> okay, because we've built some sort of extension there. All right, well, let's leave that because that seems like we might need that. I think this door needs to be a double door. Ooh. Let's do this. Maybe if we change. Oops. Duh. I like this wood, but. Oh, well, that's perfect. Are you kidding me with this? You gotta do every single... What? This is bizarre. Okay, one more. That looks really good, I think. Okay, now, will they have steps in this color? That is the question. Oh my goodness. Is it our lucky day? Is today our lucky day? I think it is. That looks really good. I wish I put a bay window there. Does it come in the grayish color? Oh my god. Um, today is just turning out good. I mean, for real. That looks really nice. I like that a lot. I almost want to do a bay window back here too, because that looks so cool. Let's see what that looks like if we put one back here. Oh yeah. That looks nice. All right, and that's got one of those windows too that's really ugly. Okay, great. Let's get rid of that, but that means we still have to find a little window, so let's do that. And I think, I think I almost need something with a shutter, but I don't, I think these are too big. Let me just 
Okay. Well, we could do that. Does that look super weird? I bet it looks weird on the inside. I really like it though. I don't want it to be different. And this looks like it needs another one. Does that look great? Yeah, that looks more symmetrical. I like that. All right. Now. Uh, you know what we should do though? Oh, I hate to do it because then I have to get rid of my, my um, bay window. But I'm thinking we should make like a little deck right here. We're going to have to revamp the inside anyway, so. Yes, this looks very nice. Look at that. That looks cool. Do we want to leave this siding? What do we got? Uh, there's all kinds of choices in siding. I think what we've got is this one. I kind of like the rounded one. Ooh, with the blue. Oh my goodness. That is gorgeous. Yes. Oh, I love it. Let's go around and grab the same door so we're matching. Oh my God, this already looks really good, you guys. I love it so much. Oh my goodness. I want to live here for real. Can I move into the Sims house and live right on the water? Oh, so pretty. Oops. <laughs> yeah, let's make that in the middle there. Oh, that looks so, oh, that just looks so good. Let's fix this. Can we have something in blue, please? Oh my, are you kidding me right now? This, this literally is our lucky day. This is our lucky day, you guys. We are just set. Wow. I mean, this already looks so amazing. I love it. What I am going to do too is pull this side out. Okay, there's two of them there. So it matches. Do we want to do that? I feel like we could have a window here and a window here too. Ooh, that looks super nice. So I'm pretty excited about this build already and we haven't even started building. That's like amazing. All right, let's go inside and see what we got going on. All right. Well, you know we're going to have to move the stairs probably because it's right in front of the door here. I mean, that was not in that was not the way it was to begin with, but um let's um I don't know how this is going to work because the upstairs is so small. Let's get rid of the furniture and stuff so that we can have a clean slate here. Let's get rid of this whole room because I'm definitely not leaving this like this. This is weird. Yes, this is much better. All right, now I am definitely not sure what to do about this staircase. I don't really like this wall either. So let's make that go away. There's not a lot of wiggle room with this. All right, so what we could do is, that kind of blocks that off though. Can we go one more over? Oh, yes, okay, so let's put them, yeah, let's put them against that wall, which means we'll have to get rid of some of these windows, which really sucks, but. Okay, I think that'll be fine. That way it doesn't like, you know, actually let's do this, ha. That's what we can do. We can put the bathroom in this corner. Yes, that'll be nice. And that, Cause it was like right in the middle of the house. That was so weird. Yeah, I think that's nice. All right, so you walk in. I picture this is kind of the living room area. This is probably the kitchen, dining room area, bathroom over there. So that worked out good. All right, so what kind of walls do we want down here? I'm going to try to pick something I haven't done before, but I can't make any promises. <laughs> okay. I know you guys are going to think this is really funny, but I think this should be blocked off. Like right there. Okay. All right. Let's get back to the brick. We, we can totally find, I mean, there's so many brick patterns. We can totally find one that'll be cool, but oh, that's kind of nice. So we want it to go with our country kitchen, right? Let's go up. You know what I really want to do is this actually in here. Yes. Actually, I think that would look really good on the floors too. All right, let's just, um, let's just do it. I don't know about for the bathroom, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. I think also let's, um, I don't know if this staircase is the same one, but Yes, there we go. That looks nice. Now, 
This is going to be a huge kitchen. I think part of it's definitely going to have to be a dining area, probably. I don't know if that wood is too much or what. I may change that just because I feel like it is maybe a little too busy. Oh, I just said that. That's crazy, right? <laughs> maybe we'll just leave some statement walls and have the rest, like, white, possibly. Well, let me set it up. Let me set it up so that it's all done, and then we can do the decorating. We need something country-ish. Hello? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. That looks kind of like, um, what is it called that everybody... Shiplap. That's what that looks like. Kind of like that idea for this. We are ready to begin assembling the rooms. I think this looks really good. I don't, I haven't done white walls in a long time, so this is going to be weird, but I think it's going to look really cool when we're done. So, all right, guys, we are in the kitchen now. I have, I have made the entire, both rooms, um, this shiplap thing. I might change it when I'm done with the kitchen, but um, I just figured if it was all uniform, it was a little bit easier to work with. That is what I have done. I think I am also going to, I really don't want to, but I think I'm going to take away these windows just because I feel like there should be at least one wall without the windows. Might make it easier for building. Okay, let's check out what we've got in this new pack. I'm not pack kits. We got a kit. Gotta get the words right. I think what I'm going to do, my, like, as I was saying earlier, my daughter says that I don't do enough color in my builds. So I am going to, I think, make this kitchen yellow. Hopefully that will help with my, I mean, I know I do tend to do like a lot of black and white and stuff like that. So I think the yellow will be very pretty with like the blues and stuff that we've um, got going on. All right, so we've got cabinets. Let me see. I'm not cabinets, countertops. Let's see what is in these cabinets. I think what I want to do, I've been kind of looking at this. I think what I want to do is put one of these on each end like this. And then I guess by default, the stove goes in the middle probably. Yeah. Okay, so there's a yellow stove, which is cool. Yeah, let's put this here. Yes, here, yes. Put that. Yeah, do I like that? No, actually, let's take it up one. I think that'll look better. Like that. Wait, let's do the sink here. I think that'll work better. Yeah, that looks cool. Okay, so now we need... Um, I don't think we can do, oops, we need yellow. I don't think that looks, I don't think that looks right. I don't want to put that there. Is there a cabinet? Oops, sorry. Um, let's take this off for a second. Is there a cabinet that somewhat matches, I guess we need to put it on this, like that's country, well this is more country looking. Um, I mean it kind of goes with the, what's going on down here. I think that looks all right. Well, let's leave it for now and see what else we got going on <laughs> in the meantime. Um, okay, so we've got the bay window there. I think I want to do kind of a mirroring thing over here. Maybe not the same, quite the same thing, but something similar across from it. But I am going to leave the windows up. Let's put cabinets across the bottom. Yes. Okay, all the way across. Let's do these on either end. Let's do this one in the middle. I think we can put, yeah, then we can put the dishes underneath. Okay, all right. That looks really good. I do really like this set, this kit. It's really, really nice. Like whoever created this did a really good job with all the, just all the little details and all the cool cabinetry that matches. You guys know what I feel about matching. I mean, that looks really nice. Now I think, I think we need curtains here and oof, I don't know about curtains. You know, I'm really bad at this. So we could do a blind. I mean, the blinds kind of look cool, but um, what do we got in the way of curtains? Those are cute. What else? Hmm. I kind of like those because they match this part. Yeah. I kind of like those. All right. Let's do that, and then what do we have? What did they give us as far as 
Let's just, I just want to see everything that's in the kit. Oh, okay. Okay. Look at this little, that's so cute. That's adorable. All right, we're going to put that there. Oh my goodness, look at this little casserole dish. That's so cute. Let's see what else we've got here. The shelf. The shelf is adorable. Yeah, we could put the shelf there. Now, what can go on this shelf? I'm assuming, yeah, like that. Can this go up there? Nope. What about this? Ooh, yeah, that can go up there. Um, can the flowers go up there? No, of course not. Darn it. What is this? So this cannot. It kind of looks like a casserole dish too. I feel like this looks like, um, like one of those old fashioned like buffet things. Yeah, that looks really cool. Okay. Oof. I really like this kitchen. It looks so beautiful. I do like the yellow. My daughter was right. Looking beautiful, of course. Should we continue these over here? Yeah, that looks nice. I guess we can put a table right here. That'll be really, I think that's the most logical place anyway. Oh, that's nice. Okay, I like that one. Now, what kind of chairs? Ooh, there's lots of pretty colored ones. Ooh, I like that. Yeah, that looks nice. Okay, look at how cute that is. All right. Oh, you know what we've forgotten? We need to put, we need to put the refrigerator somewhere. Completely forgot about that. Let's see. Oh, you know what we could do? I have an idea. Okay, I think, oh, that's too big. All right, um, maybe here. Yes, okay, that looks nice. And then could there be like a, like a shelf or something about that? Do we have any shelves? I don't know. Oh. Oh, yes. Oh, it even comes in yellow, too. How perfect. That is so cute. Okay. Wow, this looks amazing. We might want to do like a little... Oh, this basket comes in yellow, too. Can that go on the, oh, that's unfortunate that it can't go on that windowsill. There's a lot on this counter. I don't know about all that. I mean, it is, that actually looks really cute. Okay, yeah, let's leave that. And then, um, isn't there a hanging, oh, there is a hanging, is this yellow? Oh my goodness. Yes. How cute is that? Let's put one on either side. I can't believe they have yellow ones. That's amazing. Okay, that looks really good. Is that? Yeah, that's right. Okay, yes. Even got us some plants in there. Wish we could always use more plants, but, you know, I'll try to control myself. All right, do we like these walls, or do we think we can find something better? I mean, I'm always like, you know, we can find something better, but... Oh, wait, what? That looks really nice. We could do it. Actually, we could leave part of it white and then like have the brick kind of accenting. That looks really nice, I think. Or do, do we want it all the way around? Hmm. Or that. I don't know. That's a tough one. I'm also questioning the floor choice because maybe the floor needs to be lighter in the kitchen. Do they have a tile that we could do that would be lighter? Let's see. Maybe a rug. You know what? I think a rug actually is a great idea because that would, we can keep the floor continuation so it's not so like jarring, but then we can still like bring maybe all the colors together. So let's try that. That's worked for us in the past, I think. Let's try yellow. Let's tag our colors. We've got yellow. We've got brown. Let's do light brown and black maybe? I don't know. What's that going to bring up, but we'll see. Wow, there is not much. What have we got in here? All right, what else is there? Oh, goodness. Um, This is nice, actually. Yeah, that kind of brightens that up. I still think this floor looks wonky, but I don't know what you could make it. Could you make it? I don't even know. What colors are available in this? This is it. 
mean, I don't think you want to make it too light. Unless you do the walls all brick and then you do the floor light. Perfect. Okay. That looks really good so far. I am really liking that. All right. The kitchen is done. Yay. All right. We are in the living room now. And I'm trying to decide, do we want to continue this yellow theme? Because, I mean, I think it's kind of fun and sunny and, you know, I don't know. It's, it makes it like a whole lot brighter if you have yellow in your house. All right, let's see. Let's find a couch, I guess. You always want to start with your couch. It kind of makes a theme of the whole place. I kind of, this one's kind of big and comfy. What colors does this come in? Um, we could start it out that color to begin with. Let's see what we have for chairs, and then we can maybe change the color. Ooh, I like this one from the knitting pack. And that's yellow. That's cute. Okay. That looks kind of cute together with the ye little yellow blanket thrown over the back. Yeah. Okay, let's do that. Let's find, I think, um... I think curtains are needed, definitely, to kind of spruce up the walls. That looks nice. And we, I think we probably need, like, like a table here. And we'll probably need, a, like, a coffee table right there, definitely. Let's go back to... Let's go back to living room. Yeah, that'll be easier to find things. Ooh, I kind of like this one from the laundry pack. What does that look like? Yeah, maybe that one. What else do we have? I kind of really like that yellow. It's bringing the whole vibe around. Ooh, this one's cool too. Or this one from Paranormal is cute too. I think th maybe this one from Paranormal. And then, okay, so if we do one on either side here by the windows. Okay, we definitely need to put stuff on them now. Let's find a coffee table first before we get into all that. <laughs> this one's fun. I don't really like that with it, but that's fun. Oh, I think it's this one that I'm thinking of. All right, well, let's, let's put stuff on the tables before I decide I don't like those tables, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but, oh, you know what? I think I want, oh, that's pretty. And they have that in yellow. Oh, look how cute that is. Yes, let's do that. Actually, this corner's kind of dark. Let's do this over here. Put a little light over there. I feel like this one might need a plant, possibly. Books might be a good idea. Because, you know, I know you guys are getting sick of me putting plants everywhere, but I am going to put plants definitely in this build, so <laughs> you could just get over that. Do they have yellow on this one? Yeah, this is my favorite one because it's just so cute with the little plants, you know, on either side of it. Oh, oh, but this is cute too. Oh, a little from the kitchen pack that, or the kitchen kit that I just got. But also, oh, this one, yeah. That's so cute. That's too much flowers. Okay. Too much flowers, they said. What? I think though. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? This. Always gotta have my magazines. Yeah, there we go. Gotta have some magazines to read. And now I feel like maybe there needs to be a couch over here too, like a little love seat, right? Maybe let's do it this way. Let's do it. Oh my goodness, can you guys hear that bird outside? It is quite loud. <laughs> it's like it is morning and it is time to party. Good golly. Ridiculous. So loud. I mean, I love birds. I shouldn't say that, but <laughs> it's just like, wow, okay. You hear it? <laughs> so funny. Maybe this one? It kind of matches with the pillows. All right, we'll leave that for a second. See what that looks like. Ooh, you know what we could put right there? Put a little bookcase right there. Yes. Looking for country chic here, people. Huh. Oh, what about the latter one? That's always screams country chic. I think, I still think this corner is way too dark. We need like a lamp over here or something, like a tall lamp. I mean, this one, oh, well, this one has a yellow. Um, hello. Although that one is cute. That one's cute. 
That one's a lot cuter than this. Okay, let's make that one go away. And we'll put this one in the corner. Yeah, that looks cute. Um, yeah, this is screaming big plant right there. Ah, what is this? Oh, yes. Perfect. Big statement plant. Love it. To even it out, I think we need to put one over in this corner too, probably. Not the same plant, but a different plant. What else do we have that's, yeah, that's kind of cute. I think we definitely need a rug for sure to make that all kind of tie together. So let's put on yellow. I'm afraid to put on blue, but let's do it. And then brown maybe? I don't know why I have such a hard time with rugs. Tell me if you have a hard time with rugs, because it'll make me feel better. <laughs> I am ha Whoa, this one is quite bright. Maybe we need bright. There's this yellow one. Oh, I kind of like that. And I think we need, definitely need something on the walls here. Let's take out the blue aspect and see what comes up. Oh, what are these things? Oh, I think they go on the outside, but they're kind of, they look kind of fun just to have on the inside. I don't know why, but I feel like that looks really neat. Oh, isn't this cute? I think that's the one I wanted for the kitchen, and it wouldn't work. I could have it here in the living room for the time being. Because I know what will happen. I'll be doing something else and I'll be like, oh, here's the perfect light for the living room. So I think I'm going to leave it like this for right now. You guys can tell me what you think of these being on the inside and if that just looks totally weird. I don't know. I think it looks kind of cool. Like personally, I feel like it's like in real life, it would be like something that would open up and you would have like stuff in there. Something secret that you don't want everyone to see. So, but you can't get to it very easily. So I don't know how great that would be but anyway I think they look cute so all right the living room is done so as you can see I am renovating the upstairs I got like partially into it and discovered that I was not recording so sorry that it's not the full um, full recording of what has transpired but um, hopefully you get the gist and anyway enjoy the rest of it because <laughs> I'm gonna be quiet now
Okay, we are inside now, and everything is all jankety, because <laughs> I've been working on the outside, and now the inside looks like dog do. So, anyway, I guess we're going to have to fix all that now, too. So, I'm thinking I'll just um, do a speed thing of all the fixes, because I'm sure you guys do not want to sit through all that crap so um anyway i'm gonna go about my business now and hopefully when i'm done everything will look beautiful Okay, so I finally got the kitchen the way I wanted it. Hopefully you guys like it. I changed a few things, not a lot, just tweaked a few items and added some stuff and rearranged some things. Since we did all the rearranging upstairs and outside, it looked a little bit wonky. So, um, yeah. So now I think it looks pretty good and, um, I have moved the bathroom over here, and then I think this will be some sort of a, like, a little TV, like, hangout area, so, alright, so I'm picturing, um, somewhere where they can, you know, just, like, cozy up and watch TV, so let's get to that. Alright, I think we need to pick out a, maybe, um, uh, maybe not a couch, but a love seat. Let's see if it'll be easier to do it this way. Love see, and I think I need, I'm afraid to do it, but I think I need the yellow feature on. <laughs> Yikes. I don't necessarily want a yellow couch, but I want something in that family. I feel like this will kind of go, let me see if I'm right. Yeah, because it, I mean, we've got one over here that's got the same sort of colors in it over here. Yeah, that looks nice. Okay. Let's do that, and then, um, yeah, I guess we're going to have to have it sort of in front of that window if we want the TV. I guess the TV's going to have to be there, because I don't see any other wall to put it on, so I'm looking for something kind of country, shabby chic look. Those are side tables. Okay, so maybe on that. Okay, let's see what else we got. We've got this one, which is actually very nice. Ooh, I kind of like, I like that one better. It's more, it's more what I have in my head, I guess. <laughs> okay, let's do that one. And we need a television. Um, I think this is the only one that's going to work. So let's do that one. A couch. Let's do a little side table. Let's go back to living room. It's easier to <laughs> click on things, I think. Hmm. I like this one. Yeah, I think this is probably the best color. You know, oh, you know what we could do? I have an idea. This is what I picture. I picture the... I'm still picturing the couple that's living here. <laughs> I don't know. It's probably too big of a house for them, but maybe they raised their kids here and this is now what they're left with. But I'm picturing um, like a big, a big chair right here in the corner where she's like knitting and he's like watching television here. Oh yes, this one. This one's perfect. 
see we have one that will go. This might go with it. Let's see how that looks. Does it have, um, I think it has the little, yeah, it's this thing. Yeah. A little stool to prop her feet up while she does her knitting. Now, what we need, <laughs> what we need if we're going to do all that, hopefully you guys have this pack. Yeah, what, uh, yeah, let's do the brownish one. Because that kind of matches with her little chair. <laughs> That's so cute. Okay, yeah. So, there we go. I think like a little, um, well, let's take this off. I think like a little plant probably on this. This is pretty. This, is, this comes in that yellow. Yeah. Oh, of course it doesn't. All right, let's bring it up. If you guys don't know, you can press um, nine to bring an object up to um, a level. And if you want to lower it, you can press zero. Just a little tip from me to you. And I feel like also we need maybe a plant like right here. This looks sort of empty over here. I can't think which one I'm thinking of. It's got like a little orange base. Is it this? Might be this one. Yeah, this one. Yes, perfect. Kind of matches with the orange there. It looks super bright in this room, so I don't think I'm going to put a light. But I do think we need some things on the walls here. Let's put on our filter maybe orange and yellow. Let's kind of pick up this couch. Hmm, that's kind of perfect. All right, let's put that over here on the wall. What else do we have? Oh, wow, that's too big. <laughs> oh, here, this is cute. Yes, cute. Okay, yes, I like that a lot. All right, let's just leave the orange and yellow on because <laughs> Looking for a rug, looking for a rug. Hmm. Oh, that's too small, but that's cute. Let's lay a couple down and see what we like. Because that has worked for us in the past to kind of compare and contrast. Ooh, this one's very pretty. That's very bright and beautiful. All right, what else? Okay, so we have this one and we have this one. What looks better with what's... Oh. Well, there's no contest. This one looks better with what's going on on the other side of the room. Okay, let's, um, although this one fits, well, all right, let's see. If you knock this down to a smaller size, well, you're going to have to go pretty small in this room. Hmm. I think we should just leave the orange. Does it look bad, though? I think it all kind of goes together. Yeah, it's in a separate part of the room. All right, let's leave the orange. I feel like we could put this somewhere. This kind of looks good in the kitchen, too. Should we change the rug in the kitchen? Because this can go big. What does this look like? Ooh, well, I kind of like that, too. All right, I say we change the rug in the kitchen. Yeah, that looks nice. Okay. All right, that's done. Let's tackle this bathroom. Guess we'll just do, like, a small bathroom here because um, we can do, like, a big bathroom upstairs now because of the renovation that we've done on the upstairs so yeah let's just do a small one down here The downstairs is pretty much done except for a few decorations. It looks so good, yay! I thought I'd end part one to this video with a sunrise on Brindleton Bay. Isn't it beautiful? I hope you all have enjoyed part one of the Boathouse Makeover and what I am now calling an extreme home makeover because of all the reconstruction we had to do to the house and the length of this makeover in its entirety. Stay tuned for next week where I will reveal the newly renovated upstairs and give it a makeover. Please let me know what you think in the comments below. I really do want to know what you guys think. 
I do try to provide helpful building and decorating tips in my videos and not just do speed builds like some YouTubers do. I think that's why my videos are a bit longer, but hopefully if you are new to the world of building in The Sims or have trouble with your builds, my videos will provide inspiration and knowledge to help you become a better builder and enjoy building just as much as I do. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so I can keep doing these awesome makeovers for you guys. And you can follow me on social media. I'm on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and now Facebook as Simlissa Decor. Also, all of my creations are on the gallery under Simlissa Decor as well. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.